Welcome in. Damn. Come on a little closer. Jesus. Come on in. Don't be scared. <laughs> What's your name? Oh my God. All all Jesus Christ. All of them popped. All of them. All of them. So we did get uh some pop wow. balloons. Let's go on over there and see why they ended up popping. All right. All right. Like face value. This is the type of man usually women describe that they want the good man. He's not short. Uh, he could be like 5'11", maybe inching a little bit, six feet. Decent shape. You know, fashion, not too bad. He's not like baggy jeans and sneakers. You know, nice dress shirt, not too bad. Like, hair. like he seems like the normal good guy. Good career, his own company, Airbnb. They didn't even wait to hear none of that. All of them, apart from the last lady. But they all pop their balloons. Firstly, I want to say that you're a very well-rounded young man. Like, everything that you have going on, A1. Um, it was the attraction for me and then also the height. I'm pretty tall, so. You're not pretty tall. You got heels on. Take your heels off. Stand next to him. You're going to be shorter than him. I am 6'2". So, I don't know how tall. See, he's 6'2". Um, for me, it was the haircut. Um, I think you can tell a lot about people by how they pre present themselves. Mm -hmm. And the, like... The taper on top and then like the dreads in the back is like business in the front party in the back. Okay. It's like not really Fair not enough. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> um, it was really just the hair. Um, I love the locks. I personally don't like them really long. I like, I like my men to, if they do have them, to like keep it to like a bob. Now is uh, Brian someone that's your type? Um, I would say no. And why not? Um, I'm more into someone that just dresses a little bit more. I mean, I'm, I want someone that dresses diverse, um, but just someone that for this occasion, I think you should come with your best impression. So, um, yeah, that's it. But I mean, I don't like what you're dressed up. I mean, early it looks way better than you. So I don't know these shorts. It's like you're going for a party or something like a dirt brunch or something. So go easy on my man, because I also don't like your outfit. I don't know what the hell this is, but it seems like a day party or brunch. So she has a good body, so maybe a nice dress would have been better. You're, you're a very good looking guy, I'm not going to lie. Nice height. I like the size of the jeans. You look good. Appreciate you. No problem. Let's get her. Now, is Johnny your type? Um, I would say no. Okay. <laughs> Why not? Um, just the wardrobe, just looking at the exterior. I haven't heard anything from you yet, so, you know, I can't say too much. But just from looking on the outside, I just feel, again, you know, being that this is a dating show, mm -hmm. um, you know, you got to come with your best. Indeed. I yeah. understand. Okay. Have a good night. Nice. Okay, so why did you end up popping your balloon? So I really love your demeanor. Okay, thank um, you. Very calm, very welcoming. I feel very comfortable. Appreciate it. Unfortunately, we just don't align in terms of, like, the church Okay. You know, that's fair. Um, I am an adrenaline junkie too. Okay. But yeah, the church, that's a big thing we went in a line on. I think that's very foundational. It's very important. Yes, yeah. Um, and then, yeah. All right. I mm -hmm. respect that. Definitely. And now, why did it end up popping your balloon? Just not aligned religiously, but you're dressed so nice, Appreciate so attractive. It. Thank you. Thank yeah. you so much. So, uh, gifts isn't my love language to give. Like, mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't believe in showering people with gifts, I feel like that's earned. Um, and if you're my partner and I've, and I feel, you know, motivated to do so, I will do so. But like, if that's what you come in, like, I want to be showered with gifts, wrong guy. Okay. Yep. Got it. Now, um, is he someone that's your type? Uh, he could be, he could be, but I truly believe if I was your woman, you would want to shower with me with gifts. Possibly. Mm -hmm. Nah. <laughs> All right. All right. So now is he someone that's your type? No. Okay. And why not? Just no, I, I, I can't really say. I, <laughs> it might be the tattoo on the face. Okay. That's giving mm -hmm. me like street it's vibes. <laughs> okay. I'm just saying. It I mean, everybody me, like, got a pass vibe. though. Like, but right, I'm, right. I'm very positive. I'm an optimistic person. Okay. But I understand. Sure. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so now, is he someone that's your type? Um, he's physically fit. But again, the tattoos. I mean, I got a tattoo, but I only have one. 
I'm not really attracted to the guys with a lot of tattoos. Okay. All right. Cool. And then we did get very nice. And why did you end up popping your balloon? Yeah, I ended up popping because just uh, the energy, I don't think I was kind of gravitating to it. Okay. So I just decided to pop. Yeah, for me, it's not, she's, she looks good, like I said. She's in shape, but it gives entitled energy. And if she doesn't get, the way I see it, if she doesn't get what, what the, how way, it's going to be an issue. Yeah. I see, I cool. See. So is Micah someone that you would go for? No. Okay, why not? Uh, it seems like she's saying no to every man who has rejected her, which is fair, but I doubt every man in the lineup is not her type. I guess it's height. Okay. Just a little but I've dated short guys before, but I, I just don't feel attraction. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And so why did you end up popping your balloon? So you seem like a very, very nice guy. Yeah. Um, I had to pop because you're a truck driver, you're on the road a lot, and the video games, I'm not sure how much you're into that. Yeah. Um, but you're very handsome, good looking, you seem very, very nice, so good luck. And why did you end up popping your balloon? So the reason why I popped um, was because right now I'm looking for somebody who can, you know, be there a little bit more. Um, the truck driving, you're on the road a lot, so that's, that's the reason, but very good looking, and I hope you find somebody. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> All right, now same thing. Is she someone that's your type? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. What makes her your type? Uh, I want to say, I could just. Uh, so, why did you end up popping your balloon? It was just the hair for me. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> What's wrong with his hair? I don't know. It just doesn't look done. Um, the hairline, you know, I just like somebody who looks clean, very, you know, put together. And I feel like you got to compliment me as well. So, yeah. Oh, gosh, yeah. I mean, I like her dress. She's right. His shirt and pants are not bad, but the hair looks kind of a little bit, um, you know. But hey, women are choosy. They're very picky. So as a man, if you're coming on a show like this, you're going to have to bring your A game. And Zola, what do you do? I'm a recording artist and a traveling exotic dancer. Nope. So. Oh, traveling exotic dancer. Stripper, huh? Okay, here we go. The truck driving doesn't bother me at all. So why'd you end up popping your balloon? <laughs> no, I love the cross on your neck. You know, got faith right here. Why did you pop your balloon? Tell us the reason you popped your balloon on what, not what you like about him. Because all everything you like about him doesn't matter because you popped your balloon. So tell us, lady. I saw that. Um, it's just you're in Houston. I'm in L.A. And I really don't want to do long distance anymore. I got you. You know, but I travel as well. But it's just. Yeah, you travel. So what's the what's the deal? Yeah, the truck driving, it's, it's going to be a lot. Yeah, yeah. That's lonely, right? Yeah, that's why I'm on yeah. here. <laughs> yeah. But no, nah, no, nah, I understand. I mean, we...